Howdy, hey, howdy, ho. McBeardy back with some more War Tales. Thanks for tuning on back in. We've got more of this going on for you. Uh, last time we had to stop in the middle of a, well, at the very beginning of a ghost uh, pack battle. Uh, we were on the lookout for whatever was making those tracks that killed someone or whatever on the hunt for, I don't know. I really don't know what we were on the hunt for something or other. I'm hoping that it's this, but we'll see when we're all done with this, because we're following a trail of blood. Don't know what it was. Anyway, one of the nice things is that they do allow you to save right in the middle of a battle. There's uh, quite a few games that don't allow that, so it's nice when they do. We had moved Reyes uh, on up, and uh, so now we've got a couple more baddies coming on in. Um... Yeah, I think we can have him scooch on around this way. I was just thinking the best ways for people to come on around, but I think that by the time that we're ready to deal with him, we're going to have people all around over here anyway, so not a huge deal. Alrighty, and Magwell, um, his barrage, her barrage, I guess, is going to have enough width to be able to cover both of these, and this one doesn't need to move in order to attack that guy. So, I think they could probably just have uh, Flem come on over and just smack this guy right in the jowl. Got the Ghost Boar attacking Gerard. And we can sneak on behind this one. Oh, I didn't see the... Oh, he missed the bear trap. Whew. I did not see the bear trap, so I'm glad that we were able to miss it. Um, can we kill him with wrath? No. So, unless we crit. There's a pretty good chance that we crit, but we only have two valor points, so I want to save those. Um, let's move on over. He's already gone, so the only person that we can kill... This one right here. We have a pretty good chance to do so. Oh, missed it by one. Boo. Oh, he did quite a bit of damage. Right to the back. Ooh. This guy is going behind. He's going last. Oh, come on. Boo. Nineteen. We can get that crit out. Pretty good. Not quite good enough. Oh, and now we have the poison dagger, so it doesn't matter whether we attack him from the side or not. Okay, doke. And now they're engaged. Which is fine, I guess. Alright, uh, who's going first? This guy? Okay. And then which one's going next? Oh, this is the... Okay, we've got two... We've got two that are accompanying this nightmare. Any others? No, this is a bigger, a bigger ghost pack than we've seen in the past. So... It will be nice uh, to kind of get into a little bit bigger of a fight. Ooh, that wolf is pretty quick. When's that wolf coming down? Pretty soon. I wonder if we move behind I get if that will help a little. We can still do the barrage out this way. And get all of those that are coming on in. Oh no, his uh yikes, his armor is out, so we definitely need to kill this ghost over here. Uh, roast me. This guy isn't gonna get any um bonus stuff off of killing it. Oh, when did we use? Oh, <laughs> that's when we used it. We just used that valor point right there. Fair enough. So, if we end our turn next to this guy, I will get another bonus valor point. Excellent. Hopefully, oh yeah, he will be able to target again. Dang it. Well, we will go ahead and have Flem kill this one, and 
then we're going to move him on forward, I guess, this way. Hopefully catch this ghost wolf there. And what else we got going left here? Um, let's have Reos come fight this guy. I think that we've had a couple of problems here. We needed to not have these two locked down. So that's a that's a pretty substantial problem. But it is one that we will deal with. Alright, we're gonna get him. Good, nice crit hits. And we're gonna smack this guy a little bit. And not really be able to do much about it. Just give a little smacky smack back and forth. And the nightmare, of course, coming on in. Biting of terror between these two. And Mackwell is not going to be doing much because these guys aren't going to be moving, nor is he. So we're actually going to try and get a crit off of this guy. No, shoot. Okay. And that's it. We're done. Um, oh, I thought it was on Agate. It was on Mackwell. That would have been very easy to get off of. Dang it. Alrighty, well, let's see what else we can do here. Let's go ahead and wrath him. Get that valor point. Come on around behind him. And we should be able to either stab him. Yeah, let's try to stab. Yeah, okay, nice. And then we can have Phlegm. Um, get night, get the nightmare here. Tag him. Hopefully this won't count as us being in the fog. And we could actually get that going. Hopefully we don't get terror again. Yeah, we got terror again. Dang it. Okay, yeah, well, that was a mistake. Terra! This is actually your first, first time seeing terror. Uh, I've been pretty good about avoiding it. But, when a unit flees in terror, they disappear from combat, but do not leave your troop. They will reappear once the battle has ended. So, we are good to go as he has left the battle here. Alright, well, let's have... I think that Bernard might be a better... But let's, well, maybe not. No, they're about the same. Let's have Bernard go ahead and do it. He could probably wrath him. Oh, but we're not going to get the bonus um, valor point off of it. I don't know. It is what it is. We are going to get the bonus valor point off of him coming over and killing this boar. So that will be pleasant. We're not actually going to be able to get around in here. And if we wrath... Um, Rios has yet to go. Uh, so actually we don't need for him to wrath. And Rios... Well, actually we did need him to wrath or something because he is going to be able to kill him. Which is fine. Probably. Okay. Binding of Terror, Binding of Terror. Okay, so it's these two. Bernard, you can get over here and end your turn next to him and get bear trapped because I forgot that that was there. I should have had probably roast me come around and try to kill this boar, but I didn't. He's got four terror. He's fine. Mm. That guy's going next, so roast me. Reos can kill him. Then waddle on over. And 
friend. Gerard can hit him. She probably should have had Rosemary go first, but oh well. Not that big of an issue overall. Give him the old stab of the back. Um, should I let them go? No, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill this nightmare. I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna kill him. Nice, 18 damage. Oh, he had a lot of terror. Uh, yeah, I thought, oh, because he needed to connect. He still had the other terror. I see. Ah, well, that's fine. He ran away. It doesn't, I don't think it doesn't give you a, oh, gain a trade out of it. I don't think it gives you a, um, a big, what's the word I'm looking for? Debuff for running away. And it's a chance to not suffer injuries in combat. Nice. Okay, well, we can definitely get a lot of this loot. Um, a lot of white leather, a lot of pristine fangs, a lot of red eyeballs. Not too much of the other stuff, though. We're going to repair all, and we're going to heal all. And Bernard... Bernard? Hmm. Like we were saying, I think the movement is going to be his biggest deal, because he's going to be poisoning people a lot. So, dex and movement. So I think that that movement is going to be really helpful for him. Yeah, because I don't know what to do with him. The hunt has begun. Ah, see? We did get it. Not a ghost of a chance. Okay. So, we need to camp now. Alright. Get in the stocks, sir. Got a hoodlum and a poacher. I think the hoodlum deserves the stocks more than the poacher. Poachers tend to just, you know, poach stuff. Whereas hoodlums. Hoodlums. They hood. And they lum. And that's a problem. Can't stand the hood and the lumen. Making some sausage. Some grilled pork. Some bread. That just lasts for literally ever. Don't think we got any cloth? Nope. We did. Okay. So, do we need the... Yeah, we need the... Need the valor points. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, we got a lot of valor points. I don't think that's gonna be all of them. So that's why that tent would be nice, but alas. But alas. Uh yeah, we have one carcass left, but we don't need to use it. It would be a waste to use it. Actually. And we're gonna go ahead and rest. I like keeping the alcohol because if we get, if we wind up uh, having a problem, we gained, we did gain eight. Nice. I'm not exactly sure how, but sure. We crafted the banner. What's the banner? What's the banner? What's the banner? Banner. Represents your troop and your pride. Say, companion, any assigned lieutenant will probably carry this banner everywhere. What is it, though? What does it do? It's a lot of cloth. We don't have that much cloth, but I'm going to build it anyway because I want to see what the heck in Heckerston it does. It probably does a thing. Any assigned to the tent? Well, where is our lieutenant? Come, Flem. You just stare at it. Stare at the banner, for it is yours, and you shall wear it. Uh, okay. Um, what was I saying? What were we talking about? I don't remember. That's right, uh, the alcohol. I like keeping the alcohol, um, just, uh, you know, in the inventory, because the, um, you know, if you happen to have a time 
out and about when you uh, don't have enough food to feed your troop, um, that alcohol is really helpful because it gives you happiness and your people become unhappy if you don't give them food. Strange, right? But that's how that works. Oh yeah, you're the war paint person. I don't care about that. Master Tracker. We've gained a reinforced layer of the rat, and we now can make it. To be honest, I didn't think you'd make it back alive. <laughs> he needs a better voice. To be honest, I didn't think you'd make it back alive. But obviously, I misjudged you. Not only did you survive, but you also defeated the ghost pack. This armor layer is yours. They say this used to have a more honorable name, but that its prevalence among renegades made it a subject of scorn. Oh, movement one, critical hit plus two. Nice. That's hard to be upset about. Uh, quality projectiles. That sounds pretty good. Um, oh, yeah, this is good. Now we know exactly what terror does, which was the same thing as in early access, so I knew, but now everyone else does too. And we can make the tracker's reinforced layer, or the hunter's reinforced layer. I'm not sure what they do. And we only have a certain amount of pristine fangs, which we don't have single use for the trap. Oh, that sounds awful. Um, sounds cool. Both of these, but uh, not cool enough. 10%, I mean, if you're doing 20 damage, that's only two extra damage, which might be worth it, might be enough. But I think that we're going to go with the trackers reinforced layer. Let's do it. What do you give us? Can leave. Learning the compendium. Okay. Ex eclectic intellectuals. Guard plus three. That's cool. Uh, yeah, that was the one that I was thinking would be the takey one. Yeah, okay, that's what we kind of wanted. Um, which we definitely need to learn how to do this. Oh, grease. And some charcoal. We don't have any charcoal. We have everything else. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. cool. Uh, what else did we want to do here? Anything? Nothing? Uh, we can cut some wood. Oh, our prisoner can cut some wood for us. Nice. Come on, do some menial labor for us. Hey, no, no chug on that last one. Which is pretty awesome. Might be worth it to keep her around just because. Steal their trap. We're not going to, of course, but we could. Well, and if we keep him as a prisoner, we don't have to pay him. Ah, oh, hey, there's our lieutenant carrying it around. Which is cool. I don't know how many... Uh, of us actually expected to see each one of our individual little guys on the world itself. I'm sure that's been pointed out by somebody who did a full review on this, but I've just been enjoying the the game. I haven't really been looking at that stuff too much. It probably existed in uh, early access too, but uh, am I expected to know things? got some monies. Got the chains back. Cool. All right. Uh, actually, let's see. Oh, you're an archer. No, we want more rangers, if anything. No, no, no. No, no, no. All right. Let's see what else we want to do. Um, oh, yeah, we need to, um, it's probably quicker to go back around here. Probably need to turn in our quest here. 
Uh, and we probably need some torches to go explore the ruins at some point. Yeah, let's actually, let's do that. Let's make some torches. Go explore the ruins. That sounds interesting. Hey, there's some wolves here. Or some boars, maybe. Some wolves. Nice. And we have an alpha. I like fighting alphas. It's more entertaining. Okay. Let's get these guys. Oh, we've got, yeah, there's three over there. So, let's punch a bunch of guys this way. And keep them here in this little thing so they all die. <laughs> Give this guy a little, little stab, and then we'll run back over here, back behind Reyos, and Reyos will just run right there, just to make sure that all the wolves will come over to him. Which this wolf is blocking stuff now, so this wolf might actually come over and hag it, which is not what we want, but might be what we need. When you get what you want, but not what you need. Do 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 Um. Okay. Just because mostly, if this one goes and hits Gerard, he'll be dead. So I wanted him to not be the object of focus. And we don't need to do anything with these guys, because they're going to die from a lightning strike. I think that's the best superpower, by the way, being able to determine where lightning will strike. <laughs> and by best superpower, I mean not actually the best superpower, but, like, the best power in the game. Because there's no magic in the game, except for this particular instance. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. But I also knew that, so that's pretty cool. Alright. And good old Bernard. Oh hey, we can have these guys die straight up too. We'll give this this wolf a good old stabby stab in the back here. Finish him off. And then move right back on around. And Hackett will come around. Oh, nope. Flynn. Uh, oh no. Flynn. Okay, get that defensive stance going. Hopefully that wolf will come right in here. Attack him. And then Hackett can run around. Give him the old oh wait, oh crap. Oh no 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 Okay. Um so this last person's turn, if we aren't one hundred percent sure that both wolves are going to die, we need to retreat because he will die. And as you probably know, this game is permadeath. So that's bad. We definitely don't want that. Ooh, so hopefully we can just kill him. Oh, yeah, we hit Reyes, of course. Yep, okay. And Gerard will move on up. Yeah, it's looking bad. If we had hit uh, that wolf, it might have been okay. Oh no, yeah, we can't. We can't kill a wolf. Yep, retreat. Yep, run away, everybody. Okay, yep. Yeah. Oh, and a lot of injuries. Oh, no. Oh. oh. Such a little mistake. Such a little mistake. Uh, damage half. Yeah, we need to treat that injury. Uh, well, a lot of stuff for our apothecary to use. Or to, um, 
have a reason to make more medicine. A uh, unit is slowed to half their capacity. Oh no. Ugh. Deal, can no longer deal a critical hit. That's fine. Um. Wait, what? I'm confused. How? What? He killed four of them. That's a mistake that the game has that I haven't encountered before because I've never had... Well, no, I, ha I did have to retreat once, maybe. But I think that was a boss fight. So... It wasn't really applicable. Okay. Let's see. Let's have Gerard actually be there. McDook. Uh, yeah, it should be okay. Let's have Flem move on up. Hit this Alpha. This wolf should come over and hit Flem. He did indeed. Perfecto. And then, well, we need Reos to come in behind with this guy. Actually, we didn't need Agate to be over here at all. And these are coming on up. And I talked so much about Lightning in the fight, too. Like, it just blanked, like, skipped my mind. Ah, so frustrating. <laughs> But, it's nice that we were able to just be like, nah, we good, we done. No need for craziness. Alright, hopefully Bernard can kill him. Probably not, but one never knows. Okay, got that sweet, sweet Vala point. Come in behind, kill this alpha here. Go ahead and knock him out and then get him. Eat him for breakfast later. They're all bogged down by mud over there. And we'll move on over here with Magwell. And we'll shoot this wolf here. Be done with that ten. Ooh, nice crit hit. And we'll just give him the old pound. We could do a defensive stance and do some deflection, but eh. eh. Not really all that important. And I get is gonna run on by. Oh missed the bear trap. Of course. Okay, now where is the lightning strike happening? And we definitely don't want to be in it. So, <laughs> Rayos is going to come over here. He's going to go ahead and tag this wolf. And we're going to have Roast Me come on over this way. Finish him off. Go that way. Give a little bit of space to everyone else. And can I get? Can you make it anywhere? Can make it to this guy. So we can shoot this wolf. Whoa! Nice. That's a lot of damage. He's coming on around to hit good old Gerard in the back here. And we're going to have uh, Agate come up and stab him. Give him the old stab. Give him the old stab. Uh, probably not kill this wolf, but do a little bit of damage to it. Uh, we're going to have him move on this way. This guy will move. Alrighty. Lightning will strike. 
perfectly cook this wolf right over there. <laughs> Bernard, yeah, let's have you finish this guy off. Give me the old stab. Uh, no, don't want to let them flee. Let's have you go around the other side, make it easier for the flankers. And let's have roast me. Come on up and finish you off. Just because the lightning. It freaks me out now. It freaks me out. Uh, hey, got a bunch of stuff. Including some leather, which we needed. Prepare everybody's stuff and things. I wish there was uh, an alchemy set that we could have at camp. That would be nice. But alas. That isn't to my recollection, anyway. Alrighty, and well, that's right. We can't look at the um, the map. Look around the map. Okay. Uh, we gain some more crowns after battle. Carrying capacity, recruitment cost. Cannibalism. Uh, the troop eats three less food. That's just, like, overall. Maybe we should do it, though. I don't know. Uh, we can upgrade the hitching post. And... Well, we can upgrade the fire. Cooking pot. <laughs> this is so crazy. I want to learn this just to see what the heck it is. Um, I'm so curious as to the whip. I, I just am. I'm so curious about it. We're gonna research it. We're gonna build it. We're gonna figure out what the heck it is. Because it is, it is a curiosity to me. Alright, let's go ahead and camp. Let's see, is there any danger? Danger level none. Which is perfect. We have 65 food. How do we have 65 food? It did not look like 65 food to me. Ooh, nice. It's become an experienced cook. What does it specifically does it give us other than that? Eight constitution? That is awesome. Gerard is crushed. He can't be injured. He can't be beat! Alright, um, I guess we have a lot of berries, or cherries, that's nice. Uh, I like using up as much, many of the carcasses as possible because, um, they, uh, weigh a ton. We have to make it. Let's go ahead and make the, the whip. What does that even mean? Encourage your companion, or to encourage them to work? I don't know. Um, well, we need a lot of leather, but we have a lot of leather. So, and wood. How much wood do we need for it? Zero. Zero wood and four rope. But we can make quite a bit of rope now. Uh, let's count how much rope we need. Um, we need six and four so that's 400 how much rope do we have right now five so we need five more why is it why is this why is this hard Ugh. okay Let's make the whip. Modern comforts. As you know, one of the many modern comforts is a whip. You can whip your companions to encourage them to work. What does that mean? 
Come here, Gerard. You, you're the new guy. Oh, you're our cook. What? What is? What do you do? That is not whipping anybody. Um. Magwell, come here. You're not important. <laughs> what is this? Is that their bow? Oh, their bow's just clipping through. Sure, let's, let's see what this does. <laughs> I don't know what it'll do. What is, what is this? It doesn't... It, nothing happened. <laughs> I don't, I don't know what this does. I don't know. Um, but I do think we need to dismantle a couple of things. Let's just do this nonsense, this nonsense, this nonsense, and this nonsense. Can't dismantle that. But I don't know that I would want to. I think it's pretty pricey. Forty-four. It's not that expensive, but still. Oh, and we need torches. Cloth! Cloth! Oh, come on! Oh, man. I forgot that torches required cloth. How many torches do we have? Two torches? That's not going to be enough. Boo! Boo! I went zooming around the whole world for nothing. But I think that this is actually still a shorter distance to get to the... this side. I'm sorry, everyone. I talked up going to this place, and well, we're not even going to do that. Ugh. But it is time. So we are going to go ahead and sign off for now. But thanks for watching, and I hope that everybody stays beardy out there. So have a good one.